Hey fam, I am back. I am sorry I did not come in and properly introduce yesterday's footage. I don't know, I just like to come in when I start recording and you know, say hello, be polite and speak to y'all. Um, but yesterday was so hectic for me. I was tired, y'all. When I tell y'all, I slept until about 10 something yesterday. And that was late for me. That was late for me. And then, oh God, I'm sorry, this camera is shaking. Um, I slept until like 10 something yesterday morning. And then, when I woke up, I was just so exhausted, y'all. I don't know what it was. I was just so extremely tired. So I laid in the bed for a couple of minutes. And then when I got out of the bed, um, no, when I was getting ready to get out of the bed, I realized, I was like, you're tired, girl. So you know what? I laid there. I set my alarm for like 20 minutes or so. And I went back to sleep. And so when I woke up, I still could have slept a little bit longer, but I was okay, no. It's time for me to get out of bed because my mom was coming over. And she had, I think I told her to be over, to come on over around 12 or 12.30, something like that. So I had to get up by that time and get myself straight. Um, straighten up the house, got straight. My mom came over, laughed it up with her for a little bit, had lunch, and... After all of that, it was time to get ready to go to um, Bush Gardens. So when I tell y'all, <laughs> it was cold last night. It was cold, but we had a ball. That was our first time to um, Christmas Town for the season. And when I tell y'all, for it to only be November, I did not think that that many people were gonna be out there for Christmas Town. Now, I mean, it wasn't super duper packed, but it was packed. It was packed enough where you could get bumped. Let's just say it was packed. The Christmas tree light show was so beautiful. That's always fun to see. I love the fest house. I love Oktoberfest. Just to sit in there and eat and watch a good show. That's always good. And the first show we saw for the season, we seen for the season was um Scrooge No More. And Scrooge No More is such a classic. You know, that's like a Christmas carol. And the characters and everything, oh my gosh, the actors, they do so good. It's just a great show. And I, I think out of all of the shows, Scrooge the War is probably like one of my favorites. It's up there. Because I think they have like five different shows you can catch in the theme park. I don't know, it might be five, it might be six, but Scrooge No More is up there. I don't have a problem seeing it more than one time. It's always good. And Twas the Night Before Christmas, that is another favorite, but it's too soon for them to have that out yet. I don't think they're gonna open that show until December. So um, me and my coworker Kim were already like, look, we're going back several times because we are the ones, ding, 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 ding. We are Christmas crazy. Y'all don't know how bad I want to decorate for Christmas already, but um, no, no, no. I was raised where you let Thanksgiving get past first, and then you can decorate. And so, yeah, I'm just so glad that Thanksgiving is almost here because, baby, your girl is ready to start decorating. I don't know about y'all. Um, I'm just ready to decorate. But, yeah, right now I'm making a quick run to the beauty supply store so I can find this hair. I want to go back to my locks, y'all. If y'all remember now, whoever's been here with me for a while, I used to always get um the locks. I, I think I had long locks one time. And I don't know, I'm not really feeling to do anything long this time. I really want to do something short, maybe shoulder length or right at the top of my shoulders. I want to do some locks. Um... Okay, go ahead. Where you go? Light been green. But anyway, y'all. Um, I want to do locks. I want to do like a T30 if I can find something like that. And I want to do wavy locks. Yes, I just want to do something different. Um, 
I'm going to go down here and get some gas. Hopefully, I won't have to stop at more than one beauty supply store. Hopefully, I can just find what I'm looking for right here and be done with it. But um, after I find this hair, I'm going to go over here and get some gas. And Lord, I just pray that I can find the hair that I want at Beauty to Go. I don't want to have to go further down the street and go to another beauty supply store. And then when I come back up, I did a grocery pickup for three o'clock and it is 2.33 right now. So I'm hoping that they have my order ready and possibly ready early. Cause I just jumped out for a second to step out, get out here and get this hair. And I want to get everything and then head on back home. I'm coming to get my hair now guys because my hair appointment is Wednesday, which is the day before Thanksgiving. And it's at six o'clock in the evening now. That's the time normally that I will be at home preparing my portion of the Thanksgiving meal. So, and what is it? Oh, okay, I'm gonna make sure I don't miss my turn. But that's the time I have to go get my hair done. I don't know what I was thinking. Don't even ask me. Oh, good. The beauty supply store ain't too packed. Y'all, I don't know what I was thinking, so don't even ask your girl. I should have never ever scheduled my hair appointment the day before Thanksgiving and on top of everything else like I said my hair appointment is at six o'clock in the evening I actually put in to get off work early so thank God I remembered I'm getting off early um so okay I get off work Wednesday at 12 I believe so when I get off work at 12, your girl is coming straight home. Hurry up and fix. Um, I don't know where I'm going to start, but I'm going to start. Oh, sorry, y'all. I'm going to start working on my sides and stuff. And I don't know, y'all. To be honest with you, I might start baking desserts and stuff Monday. Because I know Tuesday, when I get off work, I have to carry Marquita to her nail appointment. And I was thinking about getting my nails done too. I just want to do something. I just want my nails back on. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I want my nails back on. It is what it is. I know it's not healthy for your nails. Acrylic is horrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that. I'm always preaching that. However, I just want my nails back on. And I just want my hands to look extra cute for the holidays. Um, I already feel naked because, look y'all, my hands are ashy. So, because of my real bad dry skin. But I already feel naked because I don't have my usual wedding ring on. I had to send that away for its yearly um, service, polish, and all that stuff. So I'm used to wearing that ring. But it's okay because I have my very first wedding ring on. So I'm not naked. I got a ring on. Yeah, I got a lot going on this week. And then I was, like I said, I was thinking about getting my nails done too. So by the time I get off work Tuesday get her we had out there oh she almost fell girl if she had a fail um by the time i get marquita get back over to the nail shop she get her nails done and then i'm getting a full set mm, baby i already say no i ain't gonna feel like cooking nothing when i get home tuesday so that's why it's gonna leave wednesday for me to do everything so yeah i think um i might start cooking Monday when I get off work and just just wrap my desserts up really really well and put them in the fridge because I don't want to be doing everything Wednesday rushing when I get off work at 12 and then my hair appointment y'all is at six o'clock six o'clock gosh so and I mean Erica is not slow at all but I and I already have my hair pre-washed and everything so all she has to do is corn roll it and put the um, locks in but by the time I leave her house, it's probably going to be 7.30. And who is going to want to come home at 7.30 at night and start cooking all of that food? Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely starting Monday. Let me start running my mouth. We are getting ready to go inside the beauty supply store. Lord, please let them have the locks that I want and the length that I want. All right, y'all, let's go. Get up.
out the way Who got a watch, who got the time, I'm raising the clock Even if my feelings grind don't stop Got big dreams, want big rocks I got plans, who got talk That is real cheap, but it's really cold cost I'm trying to get these ends Building buyers with my friends chilly well beautiful cold Saturday and I'm getting ready to have brunch with my girlfriend let me hurry up and get in here because the reservations were at 11:30, and they give a 15 minute grace period and it is 11:38 right now so let me hurry up and get my butt in here and I'll see y'all when we get inside But it's already this cold and it's only what 1 30 in the afternoon so a little after 1 30 so I can imagine what it's gonna be like tonight I'm trying to decide whether I want to take the kids to see some lights or if I'm just gonna wait until maybe next weekend and do it and i'm thinking we might wait until next weekend and do it i don't know i just thought about it. i'm supposed to go back to christmas town y'all know i love christmas the holidays this is my favorite time of the year i'm just trying to figure out exactly what i'm gonna do Oof. i don't know it's just so much i want to do right now y'all and trying to think and keep stuff straight it just has my mind going sometimes i can be just like all over the place but i'm gonna get it together what i need to do is go back to writing stuff down and 
being more organized the way I used to. I used to be so organized, guys, but now it's just like, mm, I'm just not organized the way I used to be, and I really got to get back into that. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. But right now, I think I'm going to go ahead and head home. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and head home. I got some Christmas shopping to do, but I'm going to do that online. That is going to be online. I'm going to go ahead and get these kids, get them out. I don't know if my mom is still going to be joining us because um, we were going to go in Marshalls. Marshalls and Burlington, I believe. But I'm not sure if we're going to do that or not. I got to see if mama even want to still come out of the house. Because she'll say yes one minute. And then the next minute she'll just be like, um, no, I'm staying in the house. I'm just going to chill and relax. And this is a good cold Saturday to stay in the house and relax. But it's also pretty out. And y'all already know that your girl likes to be on the go. And I don't like to sit in the house that much. Sometimes I'm in my mood to stay in the house. But y'all know how it is. All right, y'all. Let me stop running my mouth and get on down this road. And... Grab the kids and head on and take them to the mall, y'all. I'm not looking forward to going to the mall, y'all. It's the day after Black Friday, so I'm expecting the mall to be very much crowded. And my kids want to pick up some things from H&M, and I am not in the mood. I'm going to go in the house. I'm going to change out of these boots I got on and put some flats on. Probably put my Crocs on. I don't even care if it go with the fit or not. It is what it is because your girl got to be comfortable and especially maneuvering between the crowds. Just pray, y'all, that the mall is not as crowded as it was yesterday on Black Friday. Online. That's why I'm online shopping, y'all. All right, let's go. Down on my luck, I got the sauce, I'ma always come up I tried it your way, that was a dub I'm taking the wheel now, cause I trust me I'ma go get these millions I'm still hoping to wish it. You always had me waiting And I'm about fresh out of patience This time we switching positions Now you under my submission like Woo. My rules Big moves Y'all heavy on the tweeting I'll disappear a whole season like Woo. Who said they looking for me? I'ma make you wait for it Spend a few racks on a shopping spree Yeah, I'ma make you pay for it Tell them give it to me when I want it, please Wait tight on I leg for it Count down for me Five, four, three, two, I want, I'ma make you wait for it Wait for it On my time Yeah, I'ma make you pay for it Just text, I know it's a toss Oh, but I hate the fact that we lost such hey, The Uber pulling up on call Tell me as you trying to fall through I'ma leave it up to you What you wanna do? Look, I'm trying to spend this time with you Know we all for do what you're doing right now Baby, 
Baby, won't you swing my way? It's been a day and I've been thinking out loud. I know I want you. Long time since the last time. I'm back home and I wanted to show y'all what I picked up in Macy's. I was looking for um a cute little, I guess, beanie hat, they call them, with a the little pom-pom on it, and some gloves. So, I wanted to do gray. These are not the exact gray, but I don't care, because it's not like my hands are going to be constantly up there by my head for you to see that the shades of gray are off. But anywho, y'all, so Macy's had a good deal on a lot of stuff, but like I said, I was in there for gloves and a hat. Oh no! Look what I did. I pierced a hole in my glove. This thing on hook. Did I? Oh, okay. Yeah, I did, but you can't tell. But anyway, y'all, Steve Madden. They had the Steve Madden text gloves. And I forgot how many different colors these came in, but um, yeah, these are the Steve Madden Tex gloves, and they are normally what twenty dollars, y'all. But I got them on sale for nine ninety nine, and I just thought these were so cute. When I tell you all, these gloves are so warm and thick, and it has this extra layer that comes in in the palm of your hand, but your index finger and your thumb. I don't know if you, it's picking up on camera, but at the very top, it's slightly different from the other tips of the glove. You can see it a little bit. And these two, you're going to use the text. And it, they work, y'all, because I tested it out before I left the store. These are super duper cute. Again, these are the Steve Madden text gloves coming up for $20, y'all. But they were on sale for $9.99. And then I tried on several hats, but I ended up picking this hat. And this brand is what? Style and Company. But um, the gloves, they had exact gloves to match this. And I had them in my hand at first. Uh, I forgot how much the gloves were, but the hat was $20. And I got the hat for $9.99, too. And like I said, I had the matching gloves to go with this hat. The gloves were text gloves by this company, too. But the gloves were super thin, y'all. Really, really thin. And so, I was just like, look, I am not going out here with these thin gloves on. Because I was like, my hands are going to be freezing. So, I did end up picking up these to go with the hat. And I don't think it's all too bad. It's okay. Because, like I said, my gloves not going to be way up there by my head anyway. So, I don't even care. But if you're looking for cute hats... And gloves, y'all. Please check Macy's out. And oh my gosh, y'all. I could have had a field day. Why is it around Christmas time when you're Christmas shopping? You always see things that you want for yourself. Best um, Michael Kors gloves and Macy's right now. So if you're interested, I'm talking about leather gloves, y'all. Run to Macy's. But let me show you what else I picked up. All right, y'all. And I had to come back and show y'all really, really, really quick what I picked up. From the Dollar Tree. Y'all, look at these mugs. These mugs are super cute. I love them. These are nice. A nice size. Big mugs. Well, not they're big, but not too big. You know what I mean? They're just right to sip your tea in, coffee, hot chocolate. I cannot wait. Because y'all know I'm a tea lover. And I'm going to be sipping my tea in these. And then a nice hot mug of hot chocolate oh my gosh i cannot wait y'all but yeah i picked these up at the dollar tree i could not believe it i was just like these mugs are coming home with me really really nice mugs y'all